Hey everybody, I'm Josh. The fuck, man? Recording is here. And I'm Jace. I'm, I'm Why Josh. Why do look so whitewashed, dude? I, th- I think it's because... Because of this? Yeah, turn that off. Or put a black screen up there. Other than that. Perfect. Make sure it doesn't play anything. It's not going to play anything. Besides, the sound's off. Alright. Uh, hey everybody, I'm Josh. I'm Jace. And we're going to watch Avatar Last Airbender. And we are going to uh, continue our... Uh, we fin- We already finished uh, the first disc from uh, this here, Avatar, uh, the complete series, Blu-ray. Uh, disc, uh, the first disc had the first eight episodes on it. Yeah, so uh, for where, bef- well before we get all that started, I need to say this. What we're doing right now is we have a thing going where on YouTube we have to, we're going to put the edited down versions of the videos onto YouTube. And if you want to see the full version... Of the the full length reaction with all the reference footage, the full episode of the reference footage, it'll be on our Patreon for patrons who pledge at least a dollar a month. I, we can't really devote it. I wish I could devote more time to this channel, but I can't. All right. So, yeah, the links link to our Patreon should be in the description below. The first, the full length for the first episode is public. It's on the Patreon, so you can go see that right now if you want to. Uh, yeah. So, okay, back to Avatar: Last Airbender. Last we saw our heroes. They were breaking out of the, uh, they had to went to the Fire Nation temple so Aang could talk to Master Roku, and they learned that... Avatar Roku, they're not masters. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Avatar Roku. So now he's like, uh, he was like, hey, Aang, you must go, you must stop the Fire Nation and the Fire Lord before <coughs> this meteorite shows up, because when the meteorite shows up... Sozin's coming. Yeah, they're gonna be way too powerful to stop. But, me being... A weeb, I have knowledge about how this is all gonna play out. They're gonna try to stop him, and they're gonna like almost stop him right as the meteor starts, and then Aang has to fight the dude during the meteor while it's front and center, and he's gonna beat him anyway. Josh, you've never seen this show before. I have not. So shut up. Okay, fine. You know who I'm looking forward to seeing again? I miss Zuko <laughs> and Iro. I want to see more Momo. The lemur? Yeah, Momo. <laughs> Yeah. All right. Now I miss it all. But all right. Let's do it. All right. Oh yeah, people said you were. Sp- people commented saying you were spoiling too much shit for me. I did not spoil anything. You're the one who kept guessing shit, and I had to slap them. I had to tell you to <laughs> shut the fuck up. All right. I'm trying to think. What are we? What else was there? Uh, right. I mean, we're still on our way to the North Pole. Yeah. Um. Uh, I mean, that's all we got. I mean, that's. I'm not entirely sure where. Zuko is going right now. I don't know if he has to go back to the Fire Nation or he's still get, going after Aang. I don't know. All right, let's go. What episode? Are we, what's the name of the episode we're watching? The next one is called the Water Bending Scroll. Okay. This is actually a kind of an interesting one. It doesn't really come to mind very much. Okay. So. Well, shh, don't tell me. I want to watch. It. I'm <laughs> okay, excited. You got it. Let's do it. Let's do it. <coughs> we gotta sync up. This is how we get sync up. You ready? Not that. Before. Like, okay, I like love... Ep- How'd you like that episode? Josh? I liked it. Uh, <laughs> I thought it was like... You know what I liked? I was like, you stole the scroll? How could you? I thought I, th- I thought they kind of brushed over it very quickly. It's like, oh, yeah, it was from Pirates. Big, big deal. Yeah, and then they're like, oh, yeah, stealing drunk. I, f- if this, I feel like if this was like an episode of Arrow or Flash, they would have dragged it out. I was like, how could you? I can't trust you now. But how could you steal it? I can't trust you now. We don't make these types of decisions... We're not those types of people. They would have dragged out the whole fucking episode. Mm, very true. Uh, <laughs> I love the... Uh, I now have a source to learn waterbending. Yes. Only certain moves, though, I think. It's definitely not going to cover the entire scope of waterbending. Yeah. But Aang was able to do enough to where like he brought that big wave over the boat. I thought that was cool. I can't wait to get into like later in the seasons, when they're fighting people, and Aang can just like be like, Ah, water blast! Ah, throw a rock at you! Uh, airbend to everybody away. <laughs> um, <laughs> I love the bit. It's like, where are you? I can't see you. I got this. Whoosh. <laughs> he puts it back. Never mind. <laughs> I was like, I was like, oh shit, man! You dispersed the smoke already. I didn't. I just didn't expect him to just <coughs> just put it back. I was like, that doesn't really seem possible, but whatever. <laughs> 
I love Momo and the iguana parrots fight. He ends up just wrapped up in the... a flag. Yeah. Yeah. I love. I forgot about I me, mean, dude. It's so it it feel it just brings like such good feelings and nostalgia to watch mm-hmm. this show again. It just it's like I love animals in like cartoons and anime. They're canonically smarter than people. Animals are like canonically smarter than people in movies they too. <laughs> like I mean, the thing with like Aang being able to water bend pretty much right off the bat without even trying. That's relatable. We've, I think almost everybody's been in a situation where like you try really hard at something and you only get so good, but then somebody else does it without even trying and they're better at it than you. Mm. It's like, God damn it. That is relatable. I, I get that. Yeah. Like, of course you get <laughs> upset. Oh, man. How long have we been recording? 30 minutes? All right. All right. Yeah, we're going to need to cut it short. All right. Yeah. This, this was a good episode. I liked it. <laughs> like Prince Zuko. Trust me, there's more where that came from. What do you mean? Wait, you mean there, you think there are bad episodes? I did see... Mentiroso! A- I did see a video called, like, the top 11 worst episodes of Avatar Last Airbender. The guy admits, he's like, yeah, it's a terrific show. And he just wanted to point out that, like, maybe things aren't... Uh... Well, nothing is perfect. Yeah, nothing is perfect. <coughs> perfect I... per- n- perfection, to me, is nothing more than a concept. It is not something that, that can be reached. Because mm-hmm. in order for something to be, to be perfect, it has to please everyone. And that will never happen. You cannot please everyone. Mm. There are people out there I... who probably think... Avatar The Last Airbender is a shitty show. And those people can go die in a hole. They have shit taste. <coughs> I love, um, I do, I, there's some moments where I just completely relate to Prince Zuko. He's like, he's like can you not see that your, your own ship is sailing? He's like, I'm, I'm done with your metaphors. It's not a metaphor. <laughs> he's, like, he's, he's, he's like, that's my boat. He's like, ha! Hands over, like, his boat's being stolen. I was like, hey! And he's like, oh, this is embarrassing. The title was in my sleeve the whole time. I would have thrown. I would have thrown. I would have thrown it too. I'd have been like, "Are you fucking kidding me?" All right. Anyways, we want to get on to the next episode. So I really, Jake. yeah, I really. I'm sorry. I, I just, really, I'm, I want to. Yeah, yeah. I like this episode. No, come back. I'll wrap it up. I just wanted to say, yeah. I mean, wrap it up then. I'm wrapping it up. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, yeah, yeah. I just, I really like this episode. I'm excited. Hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. I'm Jace. I'm Josh, and we'll see you guys in episode ten.